Hey everybody, it's Evan for MethodCast, and today I'm going to be talking about interior rendering in Artlantis. I've had a few people write to me and ask if they could learn how to do some cove lighting in Artlantis, and uh, because it's, there's no light type in Artlantis to do that specific type of lighting. So I'm going to show you how to do an interior rendering using no light sources at all and only using uh, geometry to produce the lighting. So this should be a quick one. Let's jump right into it. So what we've got here is a interior model. It's a basic SketchUp file. And uh, let me just zoom out. You can see that the this is a very basic um, box model. This is actually an, an interior project only. So if I go into these different scenes that it pulled in from SketchUp, you can see that we have the interior of the model here. And um, basically, what what we've got is you can see that the model that I built in SketchUp uses very basic colors to define materials. Remember when you bring a project into Atlantis um, and you want to separate things out by material, you want those to be like colors in SketchUp. So you can see here, um, like I have these soffits up above that are kind of curving and flowing toward the front of the chapel here. These uh, soffits up here, these red ones, those will be the same material in, Atl in Atlantis. These two light gray ones will be the same material in Artlantis. And then I have this weird purple color up here. I have a different purple color back here. I have a gray. I have a yellow. So every one of these colors in SketchUp, it's one way to do it. It's to organize your scene by color. And then those are the materials that will be like in Artlantis. Now you'll also notice that there's these yellow bands. 